Denver adventure today. We are at Dagar. It is an art room and an axe throwing room. So we're gonna get our axe on. I'm gonna get my Norse woman on. Don't have a rocking beard like this guy, but I might work on it. Going. going well. Okay, so we're here in the axe throwing cage pit. What would I call this? We're in the cage right now. The cage. Yep. Okay. Awesome. So we're in the cage. How many cages do you have in here? So we have six cages in total, um, and we there are two targets per cage, so twelve people throwing at one time in the space. Ooh. Awesome. I feel yeah. like a lot of like testosterone. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you're safe in here. Good. It's just like a batting cage. It's nothing, you know, nothing to be afraid of. But when you're in the cage, we always try to take you a little bit more. You know, you gotta take it seriously. You are in a cage with weapons, so we do have to be a little bit cautious. But perfect. Make makes complete sense. So you're definitely gonna show me how yeah. I'm gonna throw this, this. Yep, you're gonna throw that guy right there. This exactly. This guy right here. This heft to this. Oh yeah, there's a little bit of heft to them. Uh, depending on which axe you're throwing, it'll change up your whole throw. So we do have some lighter axes and also these e swing he S swing heavier ones. So. Awesome. So you're gonna teach me a little bit of technique. Yep. How to get it to stick so it doesn't like bounce off. Exactly. <laughs> and I look like a ridiculous. Should only person. take a couple throws. <laughs> awesome. How is the competition usually when people come in? Is it? People it gets, really it gets ecstatic. That's for it sure. It does. People people get really really into it and they get yeah it gets intense. Name calling comes out. <laughs> Friends friendships are broken. No, I'm just <laughs> No, everyone usually has a wonderful time all the time. It's it's hard not to have a good time when you're throwing an axe, you know? You know, I have to agree with you. I think that's yeah. the perfect way to put it. Throwing axes are amazing. So I'm going to throw it, and then you're going to come and visit, and you're going to throw it, and that's what's going to be awesome. Sounds good to me. Okay, are you ready get to get going? into it? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So you have one foot forward, one foot back. You're gonna have your weak hand on the very base of the ax, all the way down at the bottom of the ax. Your dominant hand on top, thumb along the spine. You, the reason we keep our thumbs along the spine is so that it doesn't twist side to side yeah, like that. Yeah, that makes sense. So thumbs along the spine like that. Then you're gonna bring the ax straight back over your head, almost where it's touching your back. Yep. So straight back, never over your shoulders side to side because you can get a little twist like that. Yep. Straight back, snap those arms and throw those hands directly at the target. It's easy okay. enough. It's kind of like throwing a medicine ball over your head. Can I see you do it first? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so start with a two-handed throw. Okay. One foot forward, one foot back. One foot forward, one foot back. Straight back over your head. Straight forward right at the target. Okay. This? Beautiful, yep. Yeah. And then you can come straight back over your head and really throw those arms right at the top of your head. Good. <laughs> so good first throw. <laughs> <laughs> for the first one. That was a hot throw. mess. <laughs> totally normal. Go ahead and grab that for me. All right, so one foot forward, one foot back. The again. goal would be if I stick something today. Not a human, but well, the wood. <laughs> all right, okay. so foot all the way up there, Orange John. There you go. Same thing, just aim a little lower for me. Okay. Good. So didn't get enough. There it is, nice job. What? It's stuck in the green, but at least it like hit what it would be paper, right? But it hit wood, it hit wood. That's good, it's your first of many throws. We're gonna work it, getting it to the bullseye now. We're gonna dial it in, dial it in. <laughs> nice Yay! bullseye, look at that. Beautiful throw, nice job. Thank you. Great throw. That's perfect right there. It's <laughs> exactly what we're looking for. That makes my day right there. That was amazing. Also, I'm borrowing the horns <laughs> and the hat. I got, <laughs> I think I earned it. I got a couple of bullseyes. Yeah, you did. You did great. So I think I earned a horn for a bullseye. <laughs> okay, so thank you so much. That was fantastic. That was such an awesome experience. Uh, so what's next for Dagger? So as of right now, we're still in workings of getting our beer and wine license, and then once we do that, uh, we're going to be getting on a plane, going to Seattle, LA, Wisconsin, and a bunch of other states, and just trying to open up more, but just trying to make the experience, uh, number one, safety, number two, fun, and making it a good time for everyone, and, you know, 
turning this into the next thing, the next bowling, hopefully. But. Well, I think you hit the bullseye on that one. So, congratulations. Awesome. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for coming thank in. I really appreciate you guys thank coming you. in. Thank you. Check them out, downtown Denver. Nice. Dagger. You can't miss. I mean, it's amazing. It's awesome. So I noticed that there's a box of spray paint. Here. Yes, so we actually do let um, our customers come in and spray the cages after. So if it's the end of the night, last group, you guys are more than welcome to spray the cages, throw on whatever you want, you know. Give everyone a little bit of a creative touch, a little bit of a memento for everyone at the end of their session. So. Awesome, I dig that. So I can leave my mark. You can after leave After I left mark. my mark. <laughs> whatever you want, just nothing, you know, too crazy or... Amazing. I do stick people. That's that's it. fine. That's fine. <laughs> okay. You can do what you want. I mean, and you might not even you might not even be sure that it is a stick person. They might be just like lines. Hey, put an axe in their hand and it's fine. Okay. Let's do this. Bluebeard. There it is. <laughs> that. Classic art right here. This should be in a museum.